Hemapriya. On behalf of Sri Arbindo Society, I welcome you all. In this video, I'm going to talk about New Age Experiential Innovative Ideas, which was compiled by Zero Investment Innovation for Education Initiative, that is ZIIEI. So in this video, I'm going to share you a zero investment idea, which was brought up from the state Dagar and Nagar. There was an innovative teacher from the state who described an innovative case study called New Age Teaching Techniques. So we all know that a teacher would be uh, teaching in the same format every day. So when the teacher is uh, teaching the same format, you know, the same classes, the students will really get bored. They won't get excited to learn many things. So it's the teacher's responsibility to change their uh, teaching methodologies each and every day so that uh, the students will really get engaged in those activities or that activity should be that teaching techniques should be an activity based learning outcome so that all students will really remember what they have been learned. Not, uh, not only the perspective of examination, but they'll remember everything till their lifetime. So there will be creating an innovative idea called complete the story. So complete the story in the sense, the stu uh, as usual, uh, the teachers would be narrating a story, whereas all the students have to listen that. So and they have to uh, mark it out what is question and answer. So this is a natural format. It is every in all school they would be making about all these activities, but the students want uh, want all the students to create their own stories. You know, create their own stories in the sense. Uh, let me say an example: an innovative teacher who. Uh, who would be talking about, who would be narrating about just a son. Let's say uh, a, a particular subject from a topic, uh, son. Okay, so a student has to you know, get up and the student has to tell about something, son, something about son. So first student would be, uh, teacher only will be, teacher will be introduced only a topic called son. Whereas keeping that son as a name, student should answer it. Suppose first student uh, gets up and he tells that son is round. Second student, yes, sun is round. Sun would be, uh, you know, uh, rising at that east and sets up at the west. This is how the second sentence is. Third thing, sun revolves around the earth. So sun is sun is in the round format. Sun revolves around the earth. The fourth person would be standing up. Sun is very hot, and we are very far miles away from the sun. So this is how. So every student would be, uh, you know, completing the story. Okay, in their own perspective, whatever they feel about the sun. So only the thing is, a topic would be given by a teacher. That phrases or that word should be taken out from the uh, students. So whoever uh, gives, you know, uh, correct logical and for about a sun is miles away, uh, you know, that uh, X miles away from the moon uh, or a sun is X away from the earth. So what about the miles? Okay, then I don't know. So that miles if a student tells that students would be giving an applause. And this is another thing is sun would be you know rising at, at the uh, uh, east. So that is also a thing. So many people don't know when do the sun rise and when when does the sun set. So sun sun sets at the west. So this is also a logical thing. So whoever answers these you know something logical into the story that students would be getting applause. So this is how a teacher would be introducing a small topic about sun, Ramayanam, solar eclipse about nine plants, you know, it's, it's a teacher responsibility to introduce only about a topic. And the teacher would be telling them to learn about the topic before the day. Okay, so today is this activity, which is conducting uh, an oral activity. Uh, the day before today, teacher would be telling it. So this is how you can also make implement, uh, innovate. Uh, I mean, you can also implement these innovative ideas in your classroom. If you wanted to know more about our innovative ideas, you can always subscribe to our channel called IIEI. If you're watching this video on the Facebook, make sure you like our page. Thank you so much.